Oh man, we got some dope news. What is going on everybody? How are y'all doing? We have some dope, dope, dope gaming news for you dudes and dudes. But before we get started, give the video a huge thumbs up, like, like, like. If you're not subscribed, click subscribe below. Let's get right to the news. A huge Nintendo Switch exclusive is coming to the PlayStation 5. This is in the rumor phase but this is i don't even say take this with a grain of salt this is this is happening based on the sources and what's leading up to it monster hunter rise is coming to the playstation 5 now the game launched as a nintendo switch console exclusive it later came out on the pc but now it looks like it's coming to the PlayStation 5, and I'm going to share why I'm hyped for this. This is coming from PushSquare.com. A new report from Inside Gaming claims Monster Hunter Rise will be making its way to PlayStation 5 and Xbox Series XS as soon as January 20th, 2023. That is right around the corner, January 20th, 2023. This article is saying that the confirmation is likely to come at the Game Awards. In about a week time, it should be coming. Now, this is why I'm hyped. The port is described as stunning as running at 4K 60 frames per second will support 3D audio and... Another expansion on top of Sunbreak is also coming in spring 2023. So we know the Sunbreak, the Sunbreak expansion may be included with this PlayStation 5 port, but this article is also saying another, another expansion is coming in spring 2023. This is why I'm hyped. Now, Monster Hunter Rise is the best looking Nintendo Switch third party game, but frame rate, frame rate problems, bro. This game on the PS5 at 4K 60 frames per second with the instant, the SSD, the instant load. I'm going to be back on Monster Hunter Rise. I, I will pick this up on my PlayStation 5. So this is huge, huge, huge breaking news. Monster Hunter Rise coming to the PlayStation 5. Speaking of huge news. Bro, the December PlayStation Plus Essential games have been announced. These are the games that come. If you're just a PlayStation Plus subscriber on the basic level, which I am, because I don't see the work, the, the, right now, I don't see the value in getting the higher tiers. Uh, the old school games, not really doing it for me. If they, if they ever get 3D Game Heroes, PlayStation All-Stars Battle Royale, the PS3 games on there, then I'll upgrade. But for now, the PlayStation Plus Essential Games that have been announced, three solid, solid games coming December 6th. So if you have PlayStation Plus, these are the games. Mass Effect Legendary Edition. This was the recently remastered, upgraded graphically Mass Effect games free on PlayStation Plus. The next game, another fantastic game, Biomutant. Biomutant, um, I've heard mixed reviews on this game, but this is the type of game where like, I don't know if I'm gonna buy, but if this was like free, I'd, I'd play it. So Biomutant also, also available. And this next game came out of nowhere. I don't know anything about this game, but it just got announced. 
Divine Knockout. It seems like everyone is getting on the platform brawl fighting Super Smash Brothers type game. This one, however, is in a 3D space. And so, Divine Knockout, who knows? I might do a uh, tournament with the sponsors because everybody's going to have it. It's free if you have a PS5. Uh, so, Divine Knockout, I might do a prize tournament when this comes out with the sponsors. Links in the description. Um, and so, these are the three games. Three games, Mass Effect, Biomutant, and Divine Knockout coming to the PlayStation 5 at um, on December 6th free for PlayStation Plus subscribers, which I think is dope. All right, the next news item. This is also pretty, 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 pretty cool. PlayStation tournaments have been announced for the PlayStation 5. And this is dope. These are tournaments that you can compete on for actual real life prizes straight from your PlayStation 5. And this is coming from the um, PlayStation's official blog. First official tournaments on PS5 features cash prizing and chances to win a DualSense Edge wireless controller or Pulse 3D wireless headset. So, um, new tournament feature straight from your PlayStation 5 console. And these are the games, and one of the games super hyped for, that will be included in the PlayStation tournaments. Guilty Gear Strive, NBA 2K23, my game, and FIFA 23, probably the most popular sports game. So PlayStation tournaments just been announced for PlayStation 5. This will be cool. I can't wait till they do something when Street Fighter 6 comes out. Bro, I'm thinking of college football next year. With that, that's supposed to be coming out in 2024, 2023. Um, college football finally returning. So I thought this was dope, PlayStation tournaments. And, bro, we got to talk about this next news item. Bro, the Mario movie trailer 2. The second trailer was revealed and it just put a smile on my face from ear to ear. It had uh, Rainbow Road in there. Princess Peach stole the show for this trailer. I'm afraid of showing this trailer for too long. I don't know if I get a copyright visual came for it. I don't know how they do it. But Donkey Kong. Bro, they had Donkey Kong going ham, <laughs> punching Mario in the face. It was crazy. So, new Mario movie trailer was revealed. Definitely going to be taking the, the kids. Let's see if the wife will come to. Wife and kids, we're going to go as a family to watch um, Super Mario movie. Dope, 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 dope stuff. And last but not least, Final Fantasy Crisis Core. All new launch trailer has been um, revealed from S Square Enix. The game drops, I think, December 6th, early December, something like that. But this is a prequel to one of the best, greatest RPGs of all time, Final Fantasy VII. So, Final Fantasy VII Reunion Crisis Score, December 13th. I was wrong. December 6th is another date in my head. December 13th on all platforms and it looks dope. It looks dope. I might eventually get it on my PS5. I was debating on getting it on my Switch or PS5. Either one. Uh, you can play it on the go or play it with higher fidelity. So, Final Fantasy Crisis Core. Make sure um, you check out the new... I think this is the launch trailer. So, dope, 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 dope stuff. All right. Those are all the news items for this video. What do you guys think about everything we talked about? Sound off in the comment section below. I want to know. But before you go, bro, click that subscribe button. Stay up to date. All things gaming, bro. We out. Peace. This channel that I'm about to throw out there for you guys reminds me of me back when I had like 4,000, 5,000 subscribers, man. And um, he's probably going to lose shit when I do this. But hey, man. I gotta say, my boy OB1, my boy OB1, man, that nigga is my nigga right there. He reminds me exactly of me when I was doing this shit on a smaller level. His channel, when I look at it, it's such a nostalgia trip. And he has a really cool audience too, man. And if you could show this nigga some love too, that'd be awesome. I don't shout people out unless I like them. A lot. A lot. I'm picky with that.
But um, anyways, my boy Obi One, your boy Obi One. Hey man, I got you right here, my boy. Get that man a little bit of a look, man. He reminds me of me when I was smaller. You want to take a look in the past, my boy? This is the way you do it. I got you, Jedi homie. Master, the right Jedi Master. Jedi Master. <laughs> I got you, man. You're playing two out. I got you, homie. Dedicating a workout set. <laughs> <laughs> boy, let's go, man. Right? 25, 26, 27. 28! Ah, he said he ain't on the end!